Are you tired of this dirty eggs? I am, and I'm doing something about it. This has been a good old nest box. It has served me well for many years. So this is going by the wayside. I got a better nest box. No, let me correct that. That is not entirely correct. I got the best nest box. So here is my old nest box. It's going in my wife's antique booth. This is one of her booths, that's another of her booths. So let me show you my best nest box. I love this nesting box. It's called, it's dirty. You don't have to get over that because it's been out here working, like me. Um, basically the chickens jump up here. I've got mine off the ground quite a ways, so I give them a little step stool. They jump up here. This is the ledge from the jump on. They go in, they lay, do their business. Um, you can see the mat. You know, the mat is just a plastic, kind of almost astroturfy like mat. And I do need to come clean mine out. You're supposed to spray it off every now and then. It's got a little poop on it. But um, you, to get access to the egg, what happens? The chickens will lay the eggs here in the nest box. The eggs roll down, roll down this incline, and are caught in the uh, in the box. So you raise this up to to access the eggs. Raise that up, fold this down, and we got some eggs. Now this is more than one day for me, but that's a that's a good passel of eggs. Again, they will lay the egg up in here. When they get through laying it, it does that. I haven't had any, I, uh, I had one, I think, bust. It rolled down too hard or something like that and hit and buds, busted. I, I would like to come in here, maybe put a little piece of uh, stick on weather stripping there. The chickens can't get to it because this is folded up. So that, it, they're not gonna mess with the weather stripping. Um, you give it some, you know, some kind of bumper pad, basically, when it comes down here, it bumps. Now, some of these look like, um, I'm trying to show you one. Looks like it's busted, kind of got a crack in it, but that's just the, uh, maybe it's called bloom. It's the slime that's on the egg when it comes out of the chicken, and as it rolls down, it kind of marks the egg like that. There you go. Just kind of marks marks the egg there's nothing wrong with it. it's not cracked by any means so anyway what are the advantages with this well the, the chicken first of all she's not going to go broody because there's no egg to nest on or she shouldn't go broody let's put it that way i haven't had any um because there's no eggs to nest on they all roll away they shouldn't get pecked i've got one chicken that i don't know what she does she pecks it before it rolls down the hill every now and then not often but every now and then she'll peck one before it rolls i don't know whether she catches it <laughs> she turns around her head turns her head around on her butt before she before it rolls down i don't know what she's doing but i got one that occasionally will peck one of the eggs or peck her egg i guess uh very little poop on it every now and then you know the girl's squeezing kind of hard you know how that is mama mama squeezing out a youngin and every now and then you get a little poop poop happens sometimes so that's what's happening there but very seldom most of the poop if there is any stays up in here doesn't come down with the egg but this is just a really really nice thing i did put some wood chips um, shavings to get them to get up in here because they were a little hesitant at first 
first of all I taped a couple of these up like here on top for uh, for them to get access and uh, for a few days and then I put some wood chips on there which was what I had in the original one and uh, that helped them to kind of gain access and, and want to come in but anyway they're the eggs I love the best nest box get you one I'll have a link below the video for the best nest box man I like it my life is now complete no more poop.